And in just one day, more than half a dozen air conditioners were stolen from buildings in Clayton. Yesterday, we told you about the church that was impacted by theft. And today, CBS North Carolina's Bear Shell and a learning a daycare center just minutes away from that church was also a target. Well, kids in particular are typically the ones who are at the highest risk for heat-related injuries when we're talking about the high temperatures we've seen in the last few days. And it's one reason the staff here can't understand why someone would target a daycare. And now they're having to use this as the alternative. This is the sound Clayton's Child Care Network loves to hear. And it's this buzzing noise that helps keep the kids cool and refreshed so they can stay active. Which is why Donna Leeper was concerned when that familiar sound was missing. I realized that my desk is a little warmer than normal. Um, so I immediately go check the thermostat, which I notice is off. Um, and I say, well, you know, I think to myself, you know, I need to go call the air conditioning guy. But that wouldn't have helped. The cook later found two AC units were stolen. Around the corner, a chain broken for a locked gate of another pair of air conditioners. Now only one AC unit is left. They took away from children that we provide quality care for here. It's a $20,000 loss with little payout for thieves, according to the Johnson County Sheriff's Office. Officials tell me people steal the units to sell copper scraps. Looper isn't heated about the motive or the crime. I don't think I was mad. I was sad and hurt that someone would choose to do such a thing to a child care facility. Um, you know, it could have been their child care where their children go that could have been affected, affected by the same thing. And the daycare says it does plan on adding extra security to prevent something like this from happening again. In Johnson County, Beershaw, May, CBS, North Carolina.